I'm going to show you how to needle felt a ladybug today. So we're going to take a little bit of core fiber and we're going to roll it in a ball um, and we're going to try to make the bottom flat. So once you kind of get a ball, you're going to stab it with your needle to try to get the shape. So the back's going to be flat. You'll turn it over, you kind of start to see a shape. You can just move it around. And you'll continue to do this until you get your desired shape and it's firmer. <laughs> After about three to four minutes, it looks a lot smaller and tighter. So now I'm going to create the head portion right here. So same thing, we're going to take a little bit of the core fiber and we're going to shape it like this, kind of like a ball here and we're a little on the flat side here. And I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to shape it. I left a little bit of loose fiber here at the end so it's going to be easier to connect the head to the body. So I only spent very little time to just get the basic shape here. And now I'm going to connect it by um, felting in the loose fiber, just like this. I'm going to want to do it all around very carefully. Now the head is attached to the body and you can start shaping it just like you, um, you want. And I'm sort of seeing a little bit flat here, so I'm going to add a little bit of pef to make the back a little rounder. So you can always fix it um, and make it look exactly the way you want it. I'm going to do this very quickly here. Okay, now it's a little rounder on top. Now I'm going to take the red, this is Suri Alpaca. I'm going to wrap this around the body just like this and then I'm going to needle felt this in and all, I ha all I'm doing is just tapping it in all around just like this and I'll do this for a few more minutes so you're just going to continue. Next I'm going to want to cover the face so you're going to take a little bit of the fawn fiber and just to make it a little bit easier you can actually do a light pre-felt. This makes the fiber stick together a little bit so it's a little easier to felt in. Let's get a little piece like that. You can cover, that might be too big. So I'll just cover like this and start putting that in for the face or head. So the extra here, you can just pull some of the extras off if you've got too much and then you can sort of just tuck it in and since this is the underside, I'm just going to needle felt this in just like that. And if you have a bald spot, you can always add more. Okay, that's the front. Now I'm going to take the black fiber and I'm going to make the polka dots here. So I'm going to take some black fiber and the size is, you know, up to you. So I'm going to take a little bit, roll it, and that might be too big. If it's too big, just pull it apart. There you go. And now you have two balls. Okay. So you'll make six of these and then you'll place it in your ladybug. Ladybug's back. Just the dots are in and as you can see some of it looks a little dented so one thing you can do is you can just sort of even it out by um, moving it around and you can already see it's a little smoother or you can use the needle to shape it up a little bit so you don't have all those indents. Next we're going to put the center line here. You can do it two ways. You can roll a little piece of black fiber vigorously in between your hands and make a little um, a stringish thing or line or you can take um, a little bit and then twist it almost like a yarn just like that so you can do it one or the other okay so then you just put it in the center between the head and the body and then you just sort of tap it in just like that Back here. If it's not long enough, just add more. And we'll go straight in just like that. Okay, so now we're going to work on the face. So we're going to make two little eyes, a little red nose, and this little black piece here. Just like that. So you'll take a little bit of black, and now you're going to need very, very little. You'll be surprised at how little. 
Okay, let me just roll it. Okay, so there's your eye. So I'm gonna want two of these. Whoop. Okay, and then I'm going to carefully poke it in just like that. Can you see? And one more. Okay, and then I'll do the red nose and get back to you. Now I have the face on and I'm going to try to get this black part. So what I'm going to do is take a little bit of black, just roll it between my hands so it's a little easier. I'm going to cover it like this and start tapping it in on the part where the head meets the body. Just like that. Okay. And then to get that little point here, I'm going to pull it down just a little and then hold it and sort of trace it like this in the shape. You can always add more if you want to add to it to make the shape. Go like that. And then you can sort of hold it here and almost draw with your needle, just like that. So you're getting the shape. Okay, just like that. Okay, so I'm gonna clean this up by doing a little bit more tapping and some of the slightly balder areas, I might add a little bit more of the black fiber. And here's the ladybug, it's all completed. If you bought our Wisteria Surrey Ranches ladybug kit, you should have enough for another one or two little more ladybugs. Um, anyway, here it is. Thanks for watching. Bye.